Hello everyone. I hope you all are doing very well. And in this session, we are going to discuss about precision at the red K and recall at the red K matrix. Basically, these are part of uh, information retrieval matrix. Already we have discussed so far very, very important matrix like uh, MSE, MAPE, RMSE, MAE, accuracy, F1 score, Silhote score, and many more, which you can go through our uh, evaluation matrices playlist link who's in the description section and watch them. Here, we are going to discuss about precision at the rate K and recall at the rate K. So basically, precision at the rate K is a metric used to evaluate the accuracy of an information retrieval system by considering the relevance of top K retrieved items and it will measure the proportion of relevant documents among the top k retrieved documents right and the formula for precision at the rate k is number of relevant items in top k retrieved items divided by k here relevant items refer to the documents that are deemed relevant to the query so basically in google chrome let's say you have put some query so once you have put the query, you are going to see some the outputs on the front pages and next pages and next pages. Out of this uh, retrieved items, what is the question that what are the top K retrieved items? So let's say in your database, there are 100 items which is related to your query. But out of these 100 items, only 20 items are going to be fetched here and out of these 20 items what is the relevant documents that is called as number of relevant documents and this case this 20 that out of this data set only 20 items are fetched and out of this 20 out of this 20 whatever is the relevant items that is we are going to call as top relevant items right so on this factor we are going to calculate precision at the rate k with the help of one numerical problem right what is recall at the rate k recall at the rate k is another metric that evaluate the effectiveness of information retrieval system that your information retrieval system is how much effective right by considering how many relevant items were retrieved within top K? Within top K, how many relevant items are retrieved divided by total number of relevant items? Right. So the formula is recall at the rate K is number of relevant items in top K divided by total number of relevant items. Recall at the rate K provides insight into the system's ability to retrieve all relevant documents particularly those that are more important or highly ranked, right? So imagine a scenario where you are having an information retrieval system that retrieves documents in response to user's query. Let's consider one specific example. Suppose you have a database of 100 documents related to any specific topic, let's say medical research papers, and you want to evaluate the performance of search engine by measuring precision at the rate K and recall at the rate k right let's say you are having 20 relevant documents based on gold standard of human judgment related to a specific query with its data set when the user submits a query the search engine retrieves the top k documents based on its ranking algorithm Betterly, you will understand with the help of the example let's say we are having a search engine and we need to retrieve the top 10 documents k is 10 here in response to a query we need to retrieve top 10 items. Among these top 10 documents, let's assume five are relevant based on the gold standard. So what is precision? Precision is five divided by 10 because search engine have retrieved top 10 documents and out of this top 10 documents, five were re re relevant to our gold standard. So the precision is 0 0.5. Precision at the rate k, k is 10 here. So precision at the rate 10 is 0 0.5. That is 50%, 50% accuracy, right? Okay. Now, total number of relevant items in the data set is, let's say 20. In the data set, the total number of relevant items are 20. So recall, number of relevant items in top 10 
नंबर ऑफ रिलीवेंट आइटम इन टॉप टेन वर फाइव एंड टोटल नंबर ऑफ रिलीवेंट आइटम इन डेटा सेट इज ट्वेंटी सो वॉट इज योर रिकॉल फैक्टर जीरो पॉइंट ट्वेंटी फाइव दैट इज ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट वॉट इंटरप्रिटेशन वी कैन मैक प्रिसीजन एट दी रेट टेन इज पॉइंट फाइव इट मीन्स दैट अमोंग टॉप टेन रिट्रीव डॉक्यूमेंट फ्रॉम द इन्फॉर्मेशन रिट्रीवल सिस्टम फिफ्टी परसेंट आर रिलीवेंट टू अवर क्वेरी वॉट एवर क्वेरी वी हैव पुट ऑन द इन्फॉर्मेशन रिट्रीवल सिस्टम फिफ्टी परसेंट आर रिलीवेंट दिस इज द प्रिसीजन एट द रेट के वेर एज रिकॉल एट द रेट टेन इज पॉइंट ट्वेंटी फाइव इट मीन्स दैट सिस्टम रिट्रीव ओनली ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट ऑफ ऑल द रिलीवेंट डॉक्यूमेंट्स वॉट एवर ऑल द डॉक्यूमेंट्स दैट आर रिट्रीव आउट ऑफ विच ओनली ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट आर रिलीवेंट विच इज अवेलेबल इन द डेटा सेट विद इन टॉप टेन रिजल्ट विद इन टॉप टेन रिजल्ट only 25% of the documents are relevant documents that is recall effectiveness and accuracy is 50% that out of top 10 retrieved documents 50 were relevant to our query that is accuracy and only 25% are relevant to the our query that is recall right so these matrices are very crucial for understanding how well an information retrieval system performs in terms of relevance and comprehensiveness right a good system should ideally have both that is high precision at the rate k which indicates high relevance in top results as well as high recall that is indicating retrieval of a significant portion of relevant items so these are two Uh, matrix that is precision at the rate k and recall at the rate k under information retrieval matrix right i hope the concept is clear put your thoughts in the comment section like the video subscribe the channel and stay tuned for more such important video lectures have a nice day guys jai hind jai bharat